Today, I will teach you how to import COVID-19 data from DOH website into R without downloading the files into your local directory. First, you need the R package uh, Google Drive, which allows you to interact with files on your Google Drive. So, let's run this first. Okay. Then, this drive underscore find function allows you to to access the list of files that you open from your drive. So this is a function under the Google Drive package. Here I use the nmax equals to 10 to get only the 10 most recent files that I open from my Google Drive. It asks me to, to, to provide access of my uh, Google account, so I'll just select my account that I'm using. Okay, then check the list of files that I opened from my Google Drive. So I have here the top 10 most recent files. So here is 2020 August 23, uh, which is the data from yesterday. This is the latest file. So what we need here is the ID. So here I'll copy this ID of this case information and then I'll create an object called ID and then save it in this ID object so I just have it here and then to import the, the, the file so I'll paste this ID in, in, this, uh, in, this, in this code so to, to, read, to read the files so if you run this code it will take you some time because the file I think is like more than 50 MB so it will take some time so read that CSB is your classical function to read files from your CSB file so this is different one because you will be downloading the data from from your Google Drive and the file is a CSV data which uh, is a little bit tricky than the normal XLS file from your Google Drive. So here it's still taking time to import the data. Wait until this red uh, button disappear. Then you'll have your data in. So what's next here? So now we have our data imported in our R. So let's check our data using the library uh, library tidyverse to, to wrangle the data so I'll copy the file and then check summary of my data so oh okay I don't like this 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 column here so I have this first columns but I don't want this one so because these are just notes for now so let's remove that one select minus the column and then I want the head of my file so here's the top six rows of my data I have the case code age age group so this now is my data so what's the tricky thing here now um, in your my drive before you have this list so every time uh, there's a new data like for today August 24 it's not yet here you always need to to go to this website and open the file first so like here we for August 23 we have this case information and data collect so let's try to to, to open more files so using this website and then okay so I'll use another browser and paste the link of the site here and so click for this uh, data drop file so open it will direct you to the list of files under the COVID data uh, here you need to open the readme first open this readme first file and then go for the data drop link 
So, this is the data drop link updated August 23. So, earlier we have the file case information and data collect. So, for example, we want to we want the list for hmm, for this one. What's this one? Data collect the daily report. So, I'll I don't know, that's too big, so it will take some time for us. So I'll just check for the faster file. So this one. So we have the DOH data collect uh, version 4 baseline CSV. So I'll open this one. So it's after clicking the file, you don't need to wait for it. it actually, you can actually open this that file here and run this function again. So also I if I have to check it, so I have the the DOH data collect version 4 baseline and the files that I opened earlier. So I need the ID, for example, and then paste it here again. You can just rename this later to whatever files, if you're importing files in your R. So link and then run. So it will, so it's done reading because the files is is very small so page covid if i check that one so these are the files on that on that so it's too big i need to get the head of the file only so here is the file so now imported in my data so that's how you update uh, importing data of doh DOH COVID-19 data in R. So that's for this for this tutorial.